Change boilers reveal that Finn seems to be no longer himself. If there is a great harm in not being able to control one's emotions, it seems that a new crisis is coming, and this is causing a careless act to be committed for Finn, and it's proving a disaster in the making. But the events that Finn is having are increasing day by day, but now that Finn himself has been consumed by alcoholism, it seems that one of the new changes is coming. Porsche has decided to suspend Finn from his job, but it seems that things cannot be resolved if a serious lawsuit is being filed, because Finn himself caused a patient to die. In a recent development of GH, Finn experienced a major setback when he lost the lawsuit and was arrested. This was causing things to increasingly lose his control, as it can be seen that one of the new obsessions is causing one of the new aversions to become increasingly high. The sense of failure and pressure from the hauntings of his crimes became more and more unbearable. This is making it true that the stories that Finn is getting are expanding. It's true that Finn has never been a good person until now, and he's also committed new crazy actions related to the criminals themselves. Previously, Finn himself had also acted to kill Peter, and this is causing one of the new controls to increase. But it seems that while one of the new characterizations is getting to the point where the new story changes, are getting to the point where Finn himself is really getting haunted. After being convicted and sent to prison, Finn couldn't take it anymore. The feeling of regret and obsession over his actions pushed him into a state of confusion and despair. It seems that the storyline that Finn is having on the show is going further if he's unable to find a way out and it seems that the lack of control is causing Finn to actually be imposed. The thought of committing suicide in prison became the only way out in his mind. Although those around him tried to keep him there and support him, in this difficult moment it was all in vain in the face of Finn's despair. Remember that it's Chase and Liz who are still getting a new support when the comforts themselves are being obtained. But it seems that new events will cause death to come. Remember that there is evidence that Michael Easton's departure is on the show and if Finn committed suicide in prison, then this is making things seem more and more ambiguous. New control, Finn couldn't take it anymore and decided to face the consequences of his actions in the final and most painful way. Seemingly causing the same pain that Chase and Brooklyn were in, getting higher and higher, but it's worth remembering Finn's legacy on the show is still up in the air as Violet's own grief and new storyline developments are making one of her characteristics is being proven more and more strongly.